Hello everyone, this is Swartwest Newbie here, back with another Star Zero Republic video. Today I have for you another Star Zero Republic video that's basically going to be more of the Star Zero Republic Gunnery Commando PvP. Basically how the series works is I go into war zones, I play as a Gunnery Spec Commando, and basically help others see how the game goes, and we basically commentate over it. So basically this episode is quite a good one, I do over a million damage, do 1.1 mil. We, it's honestly a really good match on Void Star. Honestly, we play with a bunch of other vanguards and commandos. I basically, it's almost a full trooper game. And yeah, if you want to see this match, obviously continue watching. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video. As always, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for some more awesome content. And if you guys want some nice gaming glasses, check the link down below and also gaming glasses. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys later. Alright guys, so we are in a match right now. The game is about to start right here, so basically we are the attacking team for this first round of Void Star. It seems like we're basically a bunch of Commando slash Vanguard, so, you know, I actually think this is going to be quite fun, you know? Um, Troopers Unite, I guess you could say. I, I honestly don't know what you could say right here, but all I'm going to say is Troopers Unite. You know, since this guy is trying to cap it... Oh, man. No, 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 no. Oh, man. They saw that coming. All right, so... Seems like just all the troopers are right here. Just attacking, man. Trooper action. I really don't know. You know? I normally don't see matches where there's this many troopers. So, you know, this is quite a surprise and in the good way. But these guys are just totally dying to us. Oh, no. We were so close as well. Um, okay. So, seems like they're really getting the people to the side. So what I'm thinking about doing right now is kind of walking away, I guess you could say. Oh, there's a healer right here, alright? The mercenary is a healer, I understand. Alright, so let's obviously kill this guy right here. Because, you know, we don't want him healing the whole team. Looks like he's using all his defensive cooldowns right now, so... Probably wise to just kill him right there. And let's kill that guy quickly. Try and knock some people back. That didn't work too well. Alright, so basically from what I can see, that they basically are just totally di like dominating us over here. So I think the trick is is to keep them all over here, all these enemies. Try to bring them over here, attack the healer, mess with them, so they all come over here, you know? Since look, as you can tell, we have them all over here, and yep, that, that actually worked, you see? Um, people went over there and everyone's focused here. I didn't... Oh, actually, yeah. Everyone was focused fighting off Node, as you can tell, from the enemy team. And we were able to get it. Just ninja it, even though there's people here. And, yeah, basically that's how that worked. I thought that was originally on the second side, but I guess... Oh, on the second side. But... I guess people were just stupid. You know, they fought off Node, and now we own it. Okay, let's kill him real quick. Let's attack the mercenary. Pretty sure this might be the heal. Yes, it is. Go ahead and attack him. Alright, let me use supercharged cells. Go ahead, hit him with that OP attack, and he's dead. Alright, let's see if anyone's behind us. Yes, there is. There's one person, one operative. He'll be easy to kill, as you can see. Alright, so let's just go ahead and take him out. There you go, goodbye. So now that he won't be on our side and mess with us. I'm unbeatable as well. Wow, that's nice. Man, we're doing really good this round so far, I'd say. Okay, we have some people still on the side. What I'm going to do is try to keep them away from me. Just attack them every now and then. Like, not really focus on them since we don't need to focus on them. We just need to mess with them a bit. Okay, he's dead. Now let's try to focus on the node since that's what's important. Like, fighting people randomly is not going to help us here, so that's not where what we're working for right here. The trick is is just to work as a team and kill these guys fast so we can cap. So, yeah, this guy looks like he's going to be just about done. Goodbye. We have the healer, so let's quickly get rid of him. Okay, what I'm thinking is I'm going to try to cap this. Everyone try to slow him. Come on, don't let him get that attack. Oh, will we get it? Will we get it? Is there not a stealth here? Bam, we got the ball. Or what, the ball? What? I don't even know. Are we playing hot ball? I, I don't know at this point. But yeah, we just got the door. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Let's think of Hutball for a second there. But yeah, we got the door right there. And yeah, this is honestly quite a good match. I'm not going to lie, you guys. This is quite good. All right. Um, This is the assassin. It's attacking one of our fellow commandos. So let's help and just totally destroy his day. 
Okay, he's dead. Some other people over here. I'll knock them back. Okay, hold the line quickly so I don't get totally destroyed right here. Just kind of stay away from everyone and just attack from the distance. Since that's what I've been trying to do recently for gameplay-wise because the guy... Basically, these people haven't been attacking me much because I've just been staying out of the shadows and just being careful when fighting. So it's really been helping me, I would say. So That's why I've been doing That's why I haven't been dying so much by beginning a lot of damage because I haven't been focused by people, as you can see. Um, okay, I'm not going to worry too much about that guy right over there, even though he's going to attack me. The operative is weak, so might as well just kill him real quick. And now the sniper is sent... I just want to get that little armor debuff on him just to help my team who is actually attacking him. And yeah, they're all dead right there. So I'm going to go to this side. And yeah, we're just going to go ahead, head down, and we'll see what happens. Alright, so... Down here. Alright, okay, I don't want to be the first one to go into a fight right here. Because that will be just suicide since obviously I'm a commando. I'll die quickly. So... The trick here is just the keep it safe you know so over here I'm just gonna slow him down just really mess with his armor so if others attack him later then hey they have an advantage okay it looks like that this guy's getting ganked over here okay let's Kyle grenade him I know I'm fighting off node but I feel like it's needed right here and we actually got it wow okay he's escaping no you do not escape from me you do not escape from me you are dead, my friend. Goodbye. Goodbye. Come on, die. Oh, man, you're using all your defensive cooldowns. Too bad. Death is so close, man. Just give it up. There you go. Goodbye. And we're going to get the door right here. So, yeah, there we go. We got it. Wow. We have one minute, 20 seconds to spare. Now, I just got to hold them for round two, and we'll be done. Wow. This honestly was quite good. Commando power right here. Okay, we have... 10 medals. Let's see. I'm pretty sure I didn't pick it up. Yep, I did not pick up the good old daily, so might as well pick it up here, because this will probably be a win just by guess. So I'm going to use all my med shots, and what I'm probably going to do is I'm going to use my supercharge, just completely use that red wide buff for my team, so we'll be able to shoot really fast and just heal and etc. at this part when a problem happens. So if problems arise, I will activate this for the whole team since obviously we do need to use it because that will really give us an advantage over a battle. Right, I'm going to go over here f at first. Hopefully everyone doesn't go over here. Okay, looks like the Juggernaut knows what to do to attack me first. Alright. Well, it looks like now he's attacking someone else. So he's attacking the Gunslinger right here. That's understandable. He has reflective stuff, so I'm just not going to attack him at this point. Now I'm going to attack him, but... Okay, I'm actually getting attacked by people right now, so... Now I'm actually going to have to use some stuff, some abilities. Alright, so I'm going to heal myself, because I don't want to die. Don't want to die right here. Bam, there we go. Healed up. Alright, we're probably going to die. Yes, we are. We actually died first death of the game. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here. I'm not sure how it's going. Oh, I'm not sure if that blast door is doing alright. Doesn't look like it is. Alright, um. Now I'm going to go over here since there's not many that are protecting it. Alright, we just need to try to survive here. This is where I become a complete tank. Like, this is where I don't care about damage or anything. Trick here is just to stay alive and attack the teammates. Alright, here we go. We're going to have to do some stuff because I don't want him planting the door. So, this is just basically kiting around. That's right. You're not planting this door, buddy. You're not planting this door. Alright, door west. Looks like we're getting some backup right here. Someone used the raid wide ability. And yeah, basically, as you can tell, that worked. We held them off for just long enough so they couldn't cap. And yeah, basically, we just helped our team right there. So we're just going to continue to stay in this battle. Yeah, let's see how this goes. Um, Not bad. We just are totally making them fall back right here. 
Okay, he's trying to ambush me, so let me use a quick heal right here. And just get some nice hits on him. Get a nice hit when he's Kyle Grenade. And, yeah, just get some nice DPS on him. Oh, I'm getting attacked by an operative. This is not good. Um, looks like there's a healer, too, so... May not be wise to attack the operative right up front. But this operative is very, very weak. I'm not going to lie. Okay, we have the healer right here. Let me go ahead and just mess with him a bit so he can't help the team. I'm going to actually waste that, not use... Oh, yep, okay, this is why I need to use hold the line since I'm getting stunned like crazy. Alright, I have another person on me, so what I'm going to do is obviously concussion charge. Get him away from me and just finish him up right there. Alright, so I'm going to heal myself back up to perfection. There we go, incoming. I'm going to go over to this door right here. I'm just going to go use some med shots for extra heals. Oh, I'm getting some insane lag all of a sudden. That's alright. Okay, I need to fight at node, so I'm going to go over here. Okay. Just attack them a bit. Okay, I'm not going to focus on that person. It looks like they stealth the way a bit. So yeah, they can go ahead and be on the way. They'll live for now, but obviously that isn't going to turn out too well for them. Okay, we have a healer over here. We have the two healers, actually. We have both healers right here, so... Just quickly get some hits on them. I'm getting attacked as well. Oh, they actually did get the door, but you know, that's okay. Um, Still think we're going to do good, but obviously they got the first door. So you know, that's no big deal. And it, doesn't, it doesn't seem that we're going to get, so I'm just going to go ahead and kill this healer right here. And yeah, alright, he's using force barriers, so you know, go ahead and use it. Just leave him alone, it's no big deal. Just got to keep an eye on him, you know. Since, obviously, if he's running away, then it's going to be no big deal. Okay, um, he's going to attack our teammates. And since we need to keep this up as long as we can, might as well attack him and kill him right here. Because we need to delay them from getting the bridge, as you can tell right here. So, yeah. This guy's dead right now. There you go. Goodbye. Alright, um, I got a, a sniper right here. So, just keep them from capping. Yeah, it definitely seems like they can't win at this point. It's way too late in the game. How's it going over here? Okay, they're bombarding everyone, so might as well try to delay them as much as I can, even though this is basically suicide. So what I'm going to do is obviously waste all my cooldowns since I'm good as dead. Okay, let's knock him back. Just again, him a bit away from me. All right. And here comes my death. Goodbye. Rest in peace, Snoopy the Crafter. Or Sweat Tour Snoopy, whatever channel you watch. And yeah, goodbye. Rest in peace. And now we have 20 seconds left on the clock. They just made second bridge right here. And yeah, basically they obviously didn't make it to the core in time. So yeah, I guess you could say GG. And yeah, honestly, I want to see what my stats were for this game. I think they'll be somewhat decent. I don't think they'll be great, but honestly, we got 13 medals. We worked as a team, and we won. So, you know, GG. Yeah, you know, let's see what happens right here. Let's let's go. Bam. Nice. Good, o good old conquest objective points, as always. Nice. Oh, wow. We did 1.1 million damage. Not bad. Highest hit was basically 12K. Not bad. Not bad. Alright, we did some healing, you know, made it not really close to 100k, but we obviously healed ourselves, and maybe one or two people, other people. We did some objective, as you can tell, we were fighting on node, helping others, defending, and yeah, 38 kills, one solo kill, 14 killing blows. We died three times in this match, and yeah, honestly guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of the Star Zero Public Gunnery Commander PP. As you can tell, that was quite a good match. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.